Purple bead test. Amazing Grace. Ah, such a pretty song. So, what's new in Amazing Grace? Nothing. Nothing is new, but that doesn't mean it's not challenging. So we have ties. Remember we learned about ties in the White Beat song? That's two notes that are on the same line or space, and you add them together. So here we have a D. That's a dotted half note. That's worth three beats. Another D. That's two. It's a half note, so that's a three beat plus a two beat. So you hold D for five counts. That's how it works. That's how a tie works. Okay? You add them together. It's like math. At the end of the song, we have a G that's a dotted half note. That's three beats. And another G that's a dotted half note. So three plus three. I don't know. I'm not good at math, but hopefully you know. <sighs> Lots of eighth notes. Here we have a dotted quarter note followed by an eighth note. So this gets longer and then this is nice and short. You'll hear that as I play through. Do you mind if I look at this one while I play it? Please. Okay. It's interesting that this song starts with a half rest. So the first thing that you do is rest for two beats. One, two. D, G. Okay. Here we go. One, two. at the end there. I had to hold that for six counts. No, oh, don't do that. You don't want to get, you don't want to play each one. Nah, that's not how you do. You just hold it and count to six in your head. Alright. There it is. Okay. Amazing grace for your purple bead. Can't wait to hear it.